Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Here we have these, um, the airbag that I'm not bothered about it because uh, we ended up disconnecting the child bit around the corner there. Um, however, the ABS, and then if I pop this down, you can see it's all kind of amber. Um, and that is to do with tracking, as far as I know. And the fault code that we're getting is this one here. It was that before, changed it, fine. It's absent, it's intermittent, should we say. This is now the cause of it. And um, obviously, you can probably switch it off, it'll go off, and but it will come back the minute you drive like 20 yards, 30 yards, because the steering angle sensor in here picks up that the track is not straight. And in fact, it's actually probably like this, or the other way, sorry, should we say. And um, as it's going, the steering angle sensor sending a signal to the module saying, it's not straight it looks like the, the wheels turned when in fact it should be straight Do you know what i mean it's it's just sending signals in other words and then they come up when they come up this is the fault code that's linked to it um the way you can eliminate this um is basically by tracking the car and once you've tracked it so we're left with one fault code here look i'll just show you it's by tracking the car, like I said. And once you've tracked it, there you are. And then let's clear all this. But yeah, once you've tracked it, um, you then come back, plug it in, and then you go into the steering angle sensor. And then you code it in from a full lock to the left and full lock to the right. And this will then eliminate all the fault codes that are there. Um, as you can see, the airbag's gone anyway. We're not bothered about that. Um, but yeah, that's the way to do it. Um, once these are cleared, I'll show you which section to go on. So once you've come out of it, go into service, go into chassis and suspension, steering angle sensor, this one. And this uh, should hopefully get rid of the um, ABS and the traction and all the other lights in a second. So we'll hit continue, continue. I'm gonna say no. I will set some matching, okay. So it's doing that. Just gonna wait for it to pair up. There you go, it's paired it up, done. Literally as simple as that. And then it says steering angle is one degree, so if I just turn it a touch to the oh, not too much. Yep, that's zero degrees. Happy continue. Yes, continue. And the uh, that light is on. That's fine because we're going to reset it. And the way you do this, come on to here. Um, here it is. Hit it. Hit the BC once, and then hold on to the BC. There you go. Tick done. And this should really nail it. There you go, all done. And that's how you get rid of it. So here we are, yes, it's all done. And as you can see, there is no more faults uh, on the 